Jason, he's right there. Jason, he's right here. Jason, come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. There's two right on that log. Right on that log. Right over it. There's two in there. That far over him, just to the left. Oh, right. He's still in the lock. He's still in the lock. Way too high. Aim lower. Come on, come on. Oh. Did you hit him? No. No, you missed. Oh my god. Alright, well, Jason ended up going Winchester on those grouse. He got three shots off. Sorry, I, I missed all of them. We uh he's he's shooting the struggle stick, so we understand what it's gonna be like. It's just practice. He uh did you forget your log up there? Are you gonna go get it? Here, I'll go grab it, go grab the truck. Anyways, he, we're gonna dig the broadhead tip out that he broke off, but that's what you gotta do. Sometimes you just gotta fling some sticks and uh, break some arrows. We are really close to where we're gonna be camping, so we pulled off at this little vantage point that gives us a lot of uh, glassing distance over here. So we're gonna check this out and I'll kind of show you what we're looking at and uh, take a peek. We're gonna set up camp here soon and bail off. Even just doing that got my heart going. Oh yeah. I mean we're in the spot, dude. It's gonna The rig's been parked. Jason is loaded down with arrows. I got some grouse arrows in my bag and uh, we are headed in after some elk. It's perfect time right now. This is the witching hour. So we're gonna go in and run and gun on some elk. If things get exciting, I'll bust the camera out. So stay tuned, night one, let's get this done. First ever sheds. I told you we were gonna find sheds up here. Jason just walked up. Put that back in if you can. Let's get a Asley Lie picture. <laughs> Jason just walked up on a match set up here. So that is gonna start our night off. Well, thank you. Day one. This would never happen if you wouldn't have brought us here. <laughs> oh my god. I had a good feeling about this spot. Let's load these up and keep hunting, dude. <laughs> hey, let's get a picture. Yeah, most. Guys, this is why you get out and go to new spots. Stick with your gut and just get out and walk. Like, we took a random trail it's off a road. Out of camp, maybe. Yeah, we took a random trail out of camp. We we're up in these sage flats, and I told Jason, I was like, dude, how, how good does this look up here? We've never been in here before. This is just a hunch. So, we walked in here, and there's two sheds on the ground. This is his first elk sheds ever. Ever. First deer shed. He's never found a shed, no. and he just found a match set side by side. <laughs> hey, Jason, go ahead and pick up your sheds. Yeah, year. I think think so to you. Put your bow down, hold those up as a set. I'd be perfectly happy with that. I like how that one drops down like We'll that. take some pictures because this lighting is just epic, dude. That's because you saw Side by side set, first yeah. sheds ever. First ever. You're gonna kill that same bull too.
I know you can't see me well, but <clears throat> at least I can talk a little bit louder now. This, I, guys, I can't make this up. You just watched it. Jason found his first elk shed side-by-side -side set within 30 minutes of us walking out of camp to go scout tonight. We start hearing a little bit and we're cow calling and being kind of stealthy walking around. Jason tells me he hears a bugle, a little bit of a chuckle, and I'm kind of skeptical, but we start raking a tree and bugling. Sure enough, we hear him grunt down in this drainage 80 to 100 yards from us. We walk up, he rakes a tree, and this bull was 50 yards from us when he either winded us or just kind of took off, but <sighs> this is less than a thousand yards from camp, and we just had a run in with a bugling bull. It's not even September yet, so couldn't make this up if I wanted to. We are uh, pretty stoked. I don't know how we're gonna sleep tonight, but we just got back to the rig. We're gonna set up camp and make a game plan and uh, talk about what we're doing here because this is just insane. Killing up tomorrow, that's what we're doing. That's absolutely what's gonna happen. This is loaded. This place is awesome.